New at noon, city leaders in Hampton had plans to open a new community center named after Mary W. Jackson, the first African-American engineer and mathematician to work at NASA. Well, a shortage of materials is pushing back construction, but a city, a city leader told Casey Baylor that this issue is impacting multiple projects. More than a year more than a year ago, Hampton city leaders broke ground on the Mary W. Jackson Neighborhood Center. It will be run not just by city staff, but by a board of citizens, and they will help direct what goes on there. Robin McCormick, the city spokesperson, says the neighborhood advisory group running the center planned to finish construction by July 9th. But that vision to open the center's doors this summer is delayed along with many materials for the project. I talk to the engineers and, and I say, what supplies were delayed? And they look at me and say, what supplies weren't delayed? I mean, it is it has just been sort of one scramble after another. McCormick says supply chain issues are bleeding into other projects for the city, including the aquaplex and a gymnasium for a separate neighborhood center. The roof trusses, you know, that support the roof, pretty crucial, um, were two um, or more months delayed. She says items like roof trusses to computer chips are necessary to finish these projects. Since these materials are out of stock, crews are left waiting. McCormick says despite living in the pandemic for two years, Hampton city leaders didn't expect to deal with many of these issues. We all think COVID's kind of over and we're not sure, you know, you read about the supply chain thing. It's a national issue, but until you try to do something, you don't realize. In Hampton, I'm Casey Baylor for 13 News Now. Right now, Hampton leaders don't have a timeline on when they could see projects completed. They hope crews can finish construction by this fall.